Hello, I'm Tahere from Nova School of Science and Technology. I did my PhD in the area of cloud computing and currently I'm part of UNIDEMI Research Center uh, and working in the area of uh, business application of emerging technologies such as blockchain technology, digital platform and machine learning. However, here I will focus on blockchain only. Uh, since this technology is the biggest thing uh, since the emergence of internet and it's going to rebuild the future. Basically, it is a decentralized technology that can bring new form of trust amongst parties. The parties can trust the history of transaction recorded in a distributed ledger through a variety of different consensus mechanisms. The distributed ledger is immutable and transparent, where everyone can see it. It is claimed that blockchain will uh, make our food safe, our money secure, our online identities protected, or it can bring people from every corner of the world into the global economy. The first application of blockchain is Bitcoin, which is a decentralized a store of wealth a form of money that is not controlled by any central bank or government. Ethereum was the second generation of blockchain, which is an open source platform offering business, business logic programmability to smart contracts. Many decentralized applications like games and financial applications were developed on top of Ethereum network. However, it is not, um, it wasn't initially made for uh, su uh, such amount of current uh, uh, transaction. It is not scalable and it is expensive. Hence the third generation of blockchain platform like Polkadot, Cosmos, Terra Luna, Solana and so on are aiming to create a network of blockchain where they are faster and more scalable compared to Ethereum. Bitcoin, Ethereum or stable coins like DAI are a decentralized store of wealth. But there are other trends in, uh, in this space like crowdfunding ICOs and IDOs uh, as a new fund, fund raising models. Uh, also blockchain can offer a decentralized governance model where there is no central office or CEOs, um, developer work uh, from remote place and uh, major decisions are taken by just voting. Uh, another trend is DeFi or decentralized finance, which includes financial services such as decentralized exchanges and lending services uh, with no central authority in charge and only provided by smart contract. A non-fungible token or NFTs, which, I, which we hear a lot nowadays, uh, they are certifying a digital asset to be unique. Uh, basically, NFTs can be used to represent items such as collectibles, digital arts and 3D designs and it can help digital creators with supporting their copyright. Various industries have been shown interest in blockchain technologies. However, many enterprise blockchain projects failed because, uh, because of inf inefficient design framework, lack of uh, incentives to all stakeholders, or simply because the use of blockchain wasn't really necessary in the first place. Uh, in our research center, we work with different uh, projects and uh, I have developed a new enterprise blo uh, blockchain framework with several detailed layers that identifies the relevant use cases when a blockchain must be utilized and also detailed all characteristics and configuration of designing an enterprise blockchain ecosystem applicable to uh, multiple indu industries. To validate the framework, we applied the framework to an procurement system, ecosystem allowing for multiple platforms to interoperate with higher transparency and accountability. 
and providing blockchain-based timestamp and automating the bidding procedure where uh, many vendors bid for procurement. I also uh, work in another project called Odyssey Dot where uh, the goal was uh, better water and energy management in a smart city and promoting eff efficient consumption uh, behavior among citizens. We created a, a blockchain-based uh, solution. In our model, uh, we consider membership and identity management, uh, recording the consump uh, consumption of uh, resources, issuing the bill based on uh, consumer consumption, bill payment, and uh, a token economy around uh, award management and token distribution. Uh, the application possibilities for blockchain from NFT to DeFi to supply chain and so on are limitless. However, these are uh, still immature. We are exploring possibilities to bridge the gap in these areas and creating guidelines for uh, implementation and deployment of uh, blockchain-based solutions in various applications.